For the next 24 hours, I'm going to be surviving off of only Shiba Inu token. What's up fellow Earthlings? This is Shiba Inu token, the most popular meme coin on the market right now. And I'm literally going to be spending millions of them today. Time is ticking. This is going to be an extremely hard video. It is literally only 10.51 in the morning right now. We just finished a job for my company. Let's just go ahead and get started on this thing. All right, so the first thing we need to do today is get a freaking ride. And then maybe I'll get a haircut. My hair is kind of looking shaggy. We're gonna get some entertainment in today. Maybe go ride a jet ski, get a tattoo. I have no idea. Let's just go ahead and get the ride and get the heck out of here. I called several different cab companies and asked if they could accept my Shiba. With no success, I decided to go a different route. I'm gonna call one of my friends. I'm gonna see if I can pay them and Shiba Inu uh, to basically drive me around for the day. So we've got a deal guys. My friend is gonna buy me an Uber gift card online and that way I'm spending Shiba Inu to get my rides around today. Boom. I think that's gonna be the hardest part but now we have to go get some coffee and freaking breakfast. I'm hungry right now. Man, I really hope uh, someone will accept this Shibu em Shib em Emo sh Shibu em em Emo Emu Shibu Emu the, the, the Shiba Inu yeah, so I got us a Uber downtown to land. We're gonna ask the locals if they will take my Shiba Inu as payment. We just got dropped off in our Uber in the middle of downtown to land, and we're here in front of Boston Coffee House. We're gonna go inside and see if we can get some coffee and some breakfast. I'm hungry. And what I'm asking is basically, we're willing to pay you double in Shiba Inu, whatever, whatever we spend today. We just need a small coffee, and like a little tiny somebody we're starving. We literally have had no food today. Buy us a $20 meal, we'll send you $40. Essentially. Not at all. Do you think any of your coworkers might be willing to do that? Is there anybody back there that'd be willing to help us out? Okay, my mic just died and we got denied by the manager and five different waitresses. I was prepared to walk around all day to find food. Alright, so we're gonna see if one of them will pay for our food over there or take crypto and pay for a pizza. I'll eat anything at this point. Alright, wish us luck. I'm hungry. I'm sorry. What's up? Hey, um, I got a question for you. Is there, is there like a manager here? We're looking for somebody that would like to trade double whatever, like a small pizza's worth or something. Uh, and that would have to be my, my store manager. I'm starving right now. Yeah. We've been I, to like three places already. I understand. Already. It's just, I, I don't have any cash on me or any kind of card. You don't? No. Oh, okay. Okay. Right. I understand that. <laughs> Alright. Well, I appreciate it. Okay. Anybody else here deal with cryptocurrency? Okay. These are all the coins I have. Shiba Inu is the only one positive today. You see that? Right. So, literally, I have like 94 million Shiba Inu. Wow, this was so unexpected and I was so grateful. But she let me download the app on her phone and we traded Shiba Inu for a pizza. Paid for by Shiba Inu coin. Yes. Uh, 750,000 Shiba Inu for this pizza and this uh, root beer right here. Uh, so we just gotta walk from here, find a place to eat. A hop, a hop. We're gonna eat as much as possible because I don't know if this is gonna be the last meal today or not. Oh, oh, I dropped some. By the way, um, this lady at Pizza Hut she literally gave her last dollar, her last like penny out of her pocket to help us eat today. Four pieces of pizza later. Brandon is uh, only a number two. You know. Because I'm a normal person. I won the eating contest. <clears throat> it is 12.59, so um, last time we showed you guys the time, it was uh, what, 10.50 something? So about two hours. Okay. We, uh, we have an Uber on the way, we finished our pizza, Brandon gave the rest of the pizza to somebody inside the bar that was hungry, and we're going to ride some jet skis now. I've already paid for it with Shiba Inu earlier today, so uh, we're gonna go hop in our, our Uber. They're waiting right now, we gotta go. Oh no, this is the guy. This is the guy in our last video, guys. He ain't fucking going home. What's up, man? Hey. I ain't giving you no more money. You said you were going home last time I gave I you did. money. I went home. Look, I changed my clothes. I'm all good, bro. Yeah. All right, we're getting in the Uber. Let's go. Going. Uh, it's going pretty great actually. Okay. Better thing. than we expected it to go. <clears throat> Woo! 
Okay, so we just got done filling out the forms and everything we need to ride the jet skis. They're sitting right over there. Uh, they just explained all the rules to us and we are about to get on these things and go ride for an hour. Now this literally cost me about 8 million 500,000 Shiba Inus to take these jet skis out today, but it was totally worth it to me. Total value of around 250 bucks. Um, we have the rest of the day to survive, bro. We still have to freaking find some lunch after this. Um, I know I'm gonna be hungry in a couple of hours again. And then we gotta find a place to stay tonight. That's gonna be like the hardest part. Uh, all right, well, I guess uh, you guys keep watching. Hit the like button, subscribe down below if you enjoy all the content that you're watching. We're always getting out of our comfort zones and, uh, and doing things that we never really do on a regular basis. Uh, this is a tough challenge. Ride out, gonna, gonna ride out like some cowboys on horses. <laughs> Whatever that means. Since we can only survive off a of Shiba Inu token today, we don't know when our next drink is gonna be. So if I send you a couple extra bucks with Shiba Inu, can you guys pick up some waters or something when you're out? Yeah, we got you so I'll literally send you like 15 extra bucks. Here we go. Oh, nice. Bye bye phone. Before we went turbo speed crazy on these jet skis, Imran had to give us that good old crash course. for 30 minutes before the GoPro died, but I asked Brandon to whip out his phone because there was something I really wanted to do. Guys, um, I'm about to face my fear. Um, it's one of my fears too, shit, but I'm not facing right it. There. It's a dead body. What is it? It's an eyeball. <laughs> it's an eyeball. There's something floating right there, dude. Three, oh, two, oh. one. Oh. <laughs> Your hat was ready. Two, one, do it! <laughs> oh, get me out of here! Oh my god, I did it. Fuck that shit! Alright, Brandon, it's your turn, bro. I did it, you do it. It is a, um, it's fun, it's fine. Yeah, that's a shark. Bye bye! <laughs> he couldn't do it. Score for me. Wow, I uh, I actually thought he was gonna do it for a second. <laughs> We're on vacation every single day and, uh, I'm just kidding, I can't freaking sing. Whatevs, you know whatevs. Yeah, woo, All right, we're back, back to shore. Brandon, how was your first experience jet skiing, bro? That was one of the best times I've ever had in my life, bro. I appreciate you, dog. Yeah. You're the best bro ever. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, I had a good time too. Alright, so yeah, let's go spend some more Shiba Inu. I'm going to hook them up with another like 10,000 or 12,000. Um, actually no, uh, I'm going to hook them up with like another 100,000 Shiba Inu um, for a couple of bottles of water because I am thirsty and literally I don't know how long it's going to be till we can actually get some water. As you can see guys, we have no car here. Literally, we're doing this. This is real, the hardest challenge we've ever done out here on YouTube. I was in the middle of ordering an Uber and Imran and Shauna offered to take us to a nice restaurant to eat and trade for Shiba Inu. What is this? Jimmy Hula's. Jimmy Hula's. Oh, I know Jimmy Hula's. What's your, ins what's your Instagram? Get closer Cram to the Customs, camera. K -R -E -M. C-U-S-T-O-M-S, -S, Customs. Grim Customs, and I'll put it right here on screen. You guys, just go ahead and uh, blow up her Instagram and uh, let her know who sent you. Don't forget, Blue Marlin Water Sports. Blue with no E, Blue Marlin Water Sports. You guys are ever in Florida and you want to get some jet skis and have a blast like we just did, they accept Shiba Inu. <laughs> All right. Bitcoin and Doge. Bitcoin and Doge. 
Go crypto, baby! Let's go get some lunch. Yo, and getting lunch is exactly what we did. I ordered what I wanted. I saw it. I loved it. And what I mean by I loved it is this stuff with the bus in bussin', baby. And when I was leaving, I saw this really cool Bitcoin ATM, so I figured I'd record it for you. Off to the Airbnb, our Uber driver, I believe, is over here in the parking lot somewhere. Somewhere it's over here. Why do I do that Italian accent? I don't know. Is that Italian? I don't know. <laughs> After chasing my Uber ride down, I finally caught up to it, and we hopped in. I realized the day had flown by, and the time is 5.53. 5.53, headed to the Airbnb. Earlier that week, I visited the Airbnb app and I looked up a couple of places in my area. I found one that was intriguing and so I contacted the Airbnb owner and they agreed to trade Shiba Inu. Let's go. All right, we have arrived at our Airbnb destination. Thank you, Uber driver, thank you. You guys ready for the big reveal? Boom. This is our Airbnb, guys. This Airbnb cost me 8,500,000 shibs. Good old sheeps. You know what I'm saying? The meme currency of the future just bought us this right here. You ready, bro? One night cost me $250. So, yes, we are paying a premium by using Shiba Inu because it usually costs around $100 for one night. Um, but basically everybody that I used Shiba Inu with today, I paid a premium. So yes, I'm using more money than I would have, but I made $4,000 in the last month off of Shiba Inu. So I'm basically spending free money today. Can't beat that, right? Let's go inside, let's check it out. I'm especially stoked because I've never been in an Airbnb and I don't even think I've been in a house this big. So it's gonna be awesome. Number 422 right here. All right. Ah, oh, there it is. This is the door with the code. All right. Don't don't watch the code. Don't watch the code. Ah. Ah. Wow. Check it out, dude. Ooh. Oh. That's the. Uh, don't touch that. It's not a light switch. That's the uh, the thing in the sink that grinds stuff up. Here's the light switch. Here we go. Ah. Hold on. Oh. There's an outdoor fire bowl if you'd like to have a fire. Bro, we having a fire tonight? Speaking of fire, guys, if you think this video is fire, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe down below. I literally hopped in the shower as soon as I got to the Airbnb. As you can see, I was feeling like dookie. But after I got out of my hot, cold shower, I decided to freestyle in every single room in the Airbnb. We had a lot of fun freestyling in these rooms, and after that, we were super tired, so we went to bed. As for the next morning, we had big plans. Good morning. To get haircuts and maybe even a tattoo. I made calls and calls and calls on top of calls. But we had no luck getting someone to accept our Shiba Inu before the 24 hours were up. I just called an Uber and they are two minutes away. So this is our last two minutes in this beautiful Airbnb. Let me just give it a hug. I'm going to miss you, baby. <laughs> 10.35 and as you can remember we started this challenge at like 10.50 uh, yesterday morning so by the time the Uber gets us back to the house the 24 hour challenge will be officially over. Bye bye beautiful beautiful house. As we pulled away from this Airbnb I got to thinking how beautiful life really is. I own three businesses, I have three kids and a wife. It is truly amazing how I am able to even make these videos. I recently decided I'm going to chase my dreams and become the best YouTuber I can possibly be. But I couldn't do this without good friends and great people to help me along the way. We are all fellow earthlings and live on this tiny rock in the middle of space and I hope you will subscribe and follow along on this journey with me. Before this video was over, Brandon had to play one last joke on me. And the challenge is officially over. 10.55 and now we gotta go get Brandon's phone.
Brandon left his phone back at the Airbnb, so we gotta go get it. Okay, so he's literally so mad right now. He really thinks that I left that shit there, but so I'm gonna wait till we get in the car. He's mad. He's so mad right now. Just yes. he's even having his wife move the truck so that he can get the car out. I'm gonna wait till we get in the car. Now he's looking for his keys. He can't find them. He's like increasingly getting irritated. It's gonna be such a relief though when I tell him that I have my phone. Yeah, my bad, bro. Oh, wait, no. Six miles. Yep. All right, bro. You can you can actually turn around. I was just kidding. I got my phone. You're a literal liar. Yeah, I swear to God, I have my phone. Look, you're a literal liar, bro. Right here, you fucking idiot. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I had you. That's why you want to take the, the camera. Fuck out, bro. <laughs> fuck you, bro. 